If you are considering selling your home without the use of a real estate agent, I don't blame you for wanting to save money. I've met other sellers that felt the very same way. However, after it was all said and done, you know what they found out? Hello again, this is real estate broker Daryl Williams with Win Win Realtors here in Southern California. If you like our content and you are new here, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Let's get started. What they found out is selling a house for the highest price possible in the fastest amount of time with the least amount of inconveniences to you, the seller, takes knowledge, skill, and experience. Some sellers have long believed that real estate agents are overpaid for the work that they do. After having gone through the selling process on their own, here are those sellers' biggest regrets and mistakes. One of the seller's biggest regrets was the pricing of the home. The sellers believed if they had have used the professional real estate agent, they would have gotten more for their home and they would have priced the home differently. It is important for sellers to understand when buyers come to you directly, the reason they're doing so is to get a better price for your house. That's the reason they will come to you unrepresented by an agent or even come to you with an agent in hope to get a better price for your house. Another big regret or mistake the sellers say they made in hindsight, it took longer for the property to sell because they didn't use a real estate agent. Why? It was more difficult to analyze offers that they received. In some cases, it was two and three months before they actually accepted an offer because they didn't know exactly what to look for. Another reason sellers cited as a mistake or regret for not having used a real estate agent was the amount of stress involved in the transaction. The seller said they had no idea how much paperwork and detail was involved in closing a real estate transaction. Often, we don't know what we don't know. And that alone should cause you to think, should I do this on my own without any professional training or any professional knowledge in doing so? If you don't have any professional training or professional knowledge in doing that task, the answer is probably not. Question of the day. Have you ever sold a house for sale by owner? Was it a walk in the park? Or was it something that you'll never do it again? Here is an important piece of the puzzle that sellers need to know. All real estate professionals aren't created equal. And basically what I'm saying there is all real estate professionals don't have the same level of training, understanding, and knowledge about the real estate business or whatever that task is you need them to do. So it's still important that you use due diligence when you're choosing the right real estate professional. I'm Daryl Williams. This is Win Win Rule Tours TV. If you have any questions for me, don't hesitate to contact me.